AI is taking our jobs. We need to fight back. I was a 3D editor. Now, I don't have a job because of AI. I don't know why they are crying and complaining about AI. Just use AI to improve your work and become successful like me. Would you believe me that those three video clips you just saw have been created using one single prompt? And it only took me several seconds to do that? Do you remember the time that this AI video went viral on social media? And we never thought that within just three years, AI video creation would become so advanced? Recently, Google released their VO3 model, and I already made a full video about that, which has gained around 470,000 views so far. And before VO3, everyone was talking about Kling AI. So they have also released their new model, which is Kling 2.1. So today I'm going to compare these two models and show you guys which model is better in terms of quality, price, and accuracy. This video is not sponsored by Google or Kling, therefore don't worry, I'm going to share my honest opinion about these two models. Kling AI has several packages. The one I'm going to be using today is $7, and as mentioned here, we are going to get 660 credits per month, and an extra 100 credits will cost $1. For this experiment, this would be enough for me. When it comes to VO3, their basic package costs $20 a month, which includes 1,000 credits. So, let's start. First, I'm going to check previously created videos from both of these AI tools and compare them. By doing this, we can understand how these two AI models have responded to different types of prompts. This is one of cool generation that I found. It's basically a cat playing with some toys, and the cat is super realistic. The only issue is this ball. It keeps changing texture. Because of that, we can easily understand this is AI generated. This video has been created using Kling 1.6 model. So I think that's why it's not that advanced. And if you take a look at the prompt, it's a highly detailed prompt. Everything has been explained in detail. Another cool video I found is this one. This video has been created using the new 2.1 model and it's absolutely amazing. But the sound of this video is not that good. Now let's check some of the VO3 generations. Where were you on the night of the bubble bath? According to this old sea chart, the lost island isn't myth. We must prepare an expedition immediately. Okay, that's actually insane. Now, I don't think Kling AI has this type of highly accurate audio capabilities. So, we have to give some points to VO3 on that. Now, if you take a look at this prompt, it's not that long, it's simple to understand. And this prompt has explained everything in a very simple way and added the dialogues to that prompt as well. What I'm going to do is I'm just going to copy this prompt and use it on Kling AI. Now Kling AI has several features such as text to video and images to video. Unfortunately, their latest model, which is Kling 2.1, supports only with image to video feature. Therefore, we have to change the model to the previous one, which is Kling 2.0. I'm going to copy that same prompt without the dialogue part to this. And I'm not going to add the negative prompt because I want to see how accurate it's going to be with this simple prompt. And we can change the duration. It's going to be either 5 seconds or 10 seconds. They will charge credits based on the duration and the model. Since we are using model 2.0 and 10 10 second duration, it's going to cost us 200 credits. Now if I change the model to Kling 1.6, it's going to cost us only 70 credits. So I'm going to select model 2.0 and let's reduce the duration time to 5 seconds and now it will only cost 100 credits and let's generate this as you can see here it says that the approximate completion time is 14 minutes which is actually too long let's wait and see this is actually better than I expected it's very similar to the VO3 video the only difference is that this model doesn't have audio capabilities the background is perfect even this character in the map are also perfect. Now I'm going to generate a detailed prompt using chat GPT and use the same prompt on both VO3 and Kling. When it comes to creating a detailed prompt, you have to complete these five steps. First, you need to explain the character in the video, which includes what the person is wearing, what he or she looks like, and their emotions. Next, you need to explain their actions, which means what they are doing in that video. Then, you need to give some details about the environment of the video, Fourth factor is the style of the video, which can be realistic, 3D style, cartoon, or more. Finally, you have to give instructions about the camera movements. Let me give you an example. If you take a look at this prompt, first, uh, I have explained the character like this, a 25-year-old man wearing a cap and with a trimmed beard. Then I have explained his action, which is washing his car. 
Then, I added some details about the surroundings, like this, outside his house in sunny weather. I also mentioned that this video should be in a realistic style, and finally, I added the camera movement as a 360 shot from a selfie camera. Since we are using the VO3 model, I added some audio parts as well. It's too hot, I need to have some drink. Now this generation only took around two minutes, so we can say VO3 model is faster than Kling model. Now let's use the same prompt with Kling AI. I'm just gonna paste the prompt here. And another good thing is with Kling AI, we can change the size of the video. We can use horizontal aspect ratio for short videos and this square ratio for Instagram reels. I think that's a good thing. And VO3 doesn't have that option yet. I'm gonna set the duration to 10 seconds this time and let's generate this video. This looks perfect. Camera movement is different from the VO3 version, but overall the video is good and it cost me 200 credits to make this 10 second video. Now, I've created a specific prompt for ChatGPT. Once you enter this prompt to ChatGPT, you can make detailed and accurate prompts for any scenes that you have in mind. So, I'm just gonna explain the scene like this. A man walking in the Amazon forest encounters a huge anaconda, and then he runs back with a scared face, screaming, and let's make the prompt. I'm gonna ask ChatGPT to convert this into a one paragraph so that we can easily use this prompt. Now this is better. Now I'm gonna copy this prompt to VO3. I'm also gonna add some dialogue to this as well. And let's make the video. And let's add this prompt to Kling AI as well. Now I'm gonna check which AI model is faster. It exactly took me two minutes and four seconds to complete the video with VO3 and with Kling AI, it took me exactly 16 minutes. So that has to be improved. Now let's take a look at the videos. Everything was good until the snake started to fly. That was unnecessary. Let's check the VO3 version. Oh, oh, that's not, we gotta run. Did he just stomp the snake? I didn't see that coming. When comparing these two videos, I think VO3 is best. It only costs 100 credits. And the generation time is also very fast and the quality is also good. But with Kling AI, it took me 16 minutes, and even though the quality is good, we have some issues with the video, and it costs us 200 credits. So the decision is up to you. Now, let's try the image to video feature. I'm gonna select the image to video feature from the top, and let's change the AI model to Kling 2.1. And I have this image of an astronaut riding a bicycle. I'm gonna upload it here, and I'm just gonna enter a simple prompt like this. And let's make this generation. It's only gonna cost us 70 credits. Okay, this is not actually what I expected. I don't know whether it's the prompt or this model. So now let's do the same thing with VO3. First, you need to select the frames to video feature and then upload the image to this. Just like before, I'm gonna add a simple prompt like this and let's see the results. To be honest, this is 10 times better than the previous video. So this is my final conclusion. When it comes to the pricing, both models cost the same, but Kling AI has affordable packages. When it comes to the duration time, VO3 is super fast. And in terms of the quality and the accuracy, VO3 is the best. So in my opinion, VO3 is the best AI video model. So I hope you guys learned some valuable information from this video. I will see you guys in the next one.